there. Aww. Don't go in there. So you're the interpreter for her? Yeah, I didn't know what this place was. So. Well, you can't be a part participating in this. But I can't, I can't, and I also can't, like, um, stop anybody. You know, I don't, I don't No, ma'am, you're, you're negotiating a murder with her. Yeah. I'm not, though. I'm just, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna chant it, but I can't really, I can't stop What are you gonna chant? What are you going to chant? Translate. Yeah, translate. You're going to translate? Yeah, that's all I'm here for. Well, she's come to murder her baby, and they're going to do that business in there, and you're going to be the voice for her so that she understands and that she can go through with the murder. But we want you to be a voice for her baby. We love Catalina. We want to help her. God has put... See, I've seen her here before. Yeah, seen her here before. Yeah, with the man who was in your position, and he said, Catalina, he went and got his Bible and said... Psalm 139 and, and was, you know, ministering to her. I think they just met with him yesterday at his, he went to her, their house. But he says, no way, he's so I'm a pastor. I can't negotiate over the blood of a baby. So we want you to be a voice for that child. Yeah, I don't know. I just want to much I can tell her because I mean, she's going to have her mind set up on whatever. But don't participate in it. Ma'am, the, the, the Bible says, cursed are the hands that take a bribe to shed innocent blood. Yeah, I, know, she, I, I know, I know that's wrong. I didn't, I didn't even know what but here's the thing, okay. is that you're you're a paid translator for her, and that you're taking a bribe to shed innocent blood. You're part of it. I, I'm not I'm not reinventing the wheel here. I'm I'm telling you what what Scripture says, and this is where where faith be, is is reality. I mean, you either trust God in this moment or you don't. And, and the, the warning is an act of love. He's saying, don't don't be in this position. What's your name? Steven, my name's Steven. Huh? Carla. Carla. Carla, don't be in this position. Yeah. I've warned you. Now turn away. I can't. Well, you can't. Give her a ride. I cannot do that. What, 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 is she, what is she paying you? I mean, is it about the money? No, or you don't want to hurt her feelings? No, I would volunteer. Like, I helped her, like, you know, she just wanted to translate, so. And but you're helping somebody you murder a baby. About the victim, put flesh and bones to the victim. There's a victim here. I wouldn't want that from me either. I, I can we tra that, can we translate with through you to her to 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 minister to her right now? I mean, I don't know. If she, I'll tell her if she wants to listen because I'm pretty sure somebody already told her. But I don't know if she's gonna listen again. We we, okay. we offered an adoption. The the family's offered to care for her baby. But she's scared. You know her situation. She's. In. We know a little it's bit about her, her situation. It's her business. But, but there's there's solutions. God is providing solutions. But fear is like a snare and it's like a trap sometimes. And so we want to use the love of God and the power of His, His Word to convict her and you to to do what's good and right. Today. Here's the thing: if if it's if you're not here, this baby will live, right? Because it wouldn't happen. Nobody here speaks Spanish. Nobody here speaks Spanish. I know that. So, if you if you were to leave, I can't do that. Why can't you do that, ma'am? Okay, then the baby will die because you're here. Hey, well, I'm sorry, but I can't. Do that. No, you, uh, what does God say? You know, I've seen, I've seen, I've seen stuff like that. I've seen it a lot, especially on Facebook. It's sad, but I can't. But now it's going to be in your judgment. It's not. I, I just. What? I how, how, see, the, the Bible says in, in Ecclesiastes 9.3 that there's evil in our heart and it drives us mad. This is madness. You know it's wrong and you're going to do it anyways because you're, you care for her feelings or you don't, I mean, ma'am, you cannot do it yourself. You cannot translate. What, what is forcing you to translate? You know what's forcing you to translate? It's your own heart. It's captivated you, hasn't it? You, but, but you can. Why can't you say no? No's a good word. No's a good word, huh? I can't tell her no, I'm sorry. Why can't you? Is she gonna murder you? No. Is she gonna be upset with you? I mean, she probably will be upset, but I can't tell her no. Isn't that, isn't that a good reason to be upset with somebody? It says, no, I can't murder somebody. Why can't you, especially if you don't know her? Yeah, I just ask her. She just asked me if I can just try something. Please, ma'am. Please. Have compassion. Do you have kids? I can't leave. I'm pregnant. You're pregnant? Yeah. Well, 
Do you love your baby? Yeah, I love my baby, but that's not her decision. The baby... I mean, the most I can do is talk to her and tell her, like, you know, it's better to her, like, at least put the baby up for adoption. And there's a that's lot of people that will help her. She's not here's, alone. here's the thing. Yes, there's people to help her. But the commandment is to love your neighbor as yourself. To put pe other people in their shoes. And I want you to just... You love your baby, right? Yeah. Would you take your baby here? No. Think about that. Think about it. This is your baby. I want to drive it home to you. I want to, I want your conscience to be pricked. Yeah, it's gonna stay with me, family. I mean, I can put it Man, it doesn't have to. You can you can walk and be like, I did the right thing. Yeah, I got here, okay? Okay. Man. Yeah. You, you do what you did to talk to me, okay? But I have to, I have to. The Bible also says it's not also those who do such things that are worthy of death, like murder, but those who give approval to those who practice them. And this That's, is definitely. You're translating, a, a, you're it's negotiating not bad, it's a... It's not bad to translate. Huh? It's not bad to but is, you're negotiating a murder. It's not bad to translate. She doesn't speak the language. I'm just translating the have no, have no part with the, with the works of darkness, but expose them. This is your time to minister to her. All I can do is just talk to her. That's all I like. Why did the one guy refuse and put his foot down, but you don't? I cannot. You know why? Because he's a godly man. He's, he spoke with authority. And realize he was caught in it. He, he didn't know where he was going either. I mean, he was processing it. But when it came to it, he said, no. And you know what he said? They said, well, just leave me here. And he said, no, I'm not going to leave you here. I'm going to take you to your car where I, where I got you. I can't, I can't do that. That's, that's, that's godliness. Well, I just want you to do the same thing. It's a person. If I don't do it, somebody else will. But it's not on you. Not, but it's not on you. Yeah, but I, like I said, I'm just translating. She doesn't speak the language. It's not bad for me to translate. But I, like I said, I'm going to do my best. I'll talk to her. But, you know, I can't, I can't change her. You're negotiating a murder of a little baby that's just like yours. Yeah, I got a cool sign. I'm sorry. I, but I, I appreciate what you're talking to me. And that's all I can do. That's all I can do. Okay. Okay, the Bible says, if someone's burdened with the blood of another, let no one help them. They're a fugitive unto death. You're aiding and abetting a fugitive at this point. I love you, Daddy.